24 hours following a playoff loss, like how do you go through kind of the the finality of it? Um, you know, when you guys obviously have aspirations of still being on. Yeah, well, what you do is after the game, and even today, you talk about everything that could have been. That's what usually happens. Um, then, you know, it all settles in when you do the next interview. Then we got the team meeting. I mean, there ain't no other way to put it. It sucks, but, you know, it happens, you know. Where are you at mentally right now, knowing that your future is uh, at this point? I don't know. <laughs> I would just live each day, you know, take it one day at a time. Do you have any feeling on whether you'll be back or not? I have no clue. Do you want to? Of course. You know, I've been here four years. Uh, Consider this home. You know, everything take care of is uh, take care of itself. The the faith they showed you this year. Do you think that is an indication of how much they want you here? Oh, oh, tremendously. You know, I definitely think so. Uh, you know, they had my back the whole time. They're right there behind me. I'm very grateful for that. I'm thankful for that too. How would you evaluate your season this year? Um, you know, of course the numbers weren't there. You know. Uh, Everybody was expecting to come in, you know, just, you know, take over. But, you know, I don't feel like it went that bad. I left a few sacks out there that I could have had, you know. You know, as long as the team was winning, you know, that was fine. You know, it's never been about me. If I, you know, could open something up for some other guys to make plays, you know, that's what it is. That's their calling. That's their time. You know, it's a team sport.